13-13 lead. Back come the Rams with Tony Bernados from 20 yards out. The kick is up and good. The Rams lead by two. Fourth quarter now, under two minutes to go. Marcus Stone to Justin Taylor, deep. Taylor gets behind the secondary. Races 85 yards. McDevitt leads 21-16 with a buck 49 on the clock. We go to fourth down now, the Rams fourth and goal. Mike Probst to Scott Moore with seconds to go and that's the game winner. 23-21, Central Dauphin holds off Bishop McDevitt in an absolute thriller. Wow, that is a tough game to top. And to see if he can top it, let's check in with Jeff Sharilla and his friends in York County. Give me a W! The Susquehannock cheerleaders giving us a little football Friday cheer. And I have to say they're very upbeat because it wasn't exactly the greatest homecoming game here. New Oxford comes to town. Susquehannock's had a tough time moving up into Division I. They come in with only one win on the year. A surprise, New Oxford all alone in first place at 2-0. But could they stay perfect? Let's go to the highlights. <laughs> Oh, appreciate the Susquehannock fans making those signs. That these highlights, though, are all New Oxford with the pick. Mario Ioko with the INT. That sets up this on play action. Ryan Anderson to Larry Baumgartner. Heck of a night. Four touchdowns, one running, one throwing, a punt return, and an interception return. This catch helps set up Anderson on the keeper. And I'll tell you what, uh, those Colonials look an awful lot like the Patriots, but here they go. The Colonials with the touchdown run. Anderson makes it 42-0. Lone Susquehannock highlight comes just before the end of the third quarter. Brandon Davis hits Jacob Wolf 72 yards on the score. Not nearly enough as New Oxford wins it 42-14. The Colonials now 3-0 on the year. They are certainly the surprise of Division I. They stay perfect. Tough loss for Susquehannock. We've got the cheerleaders, the band, and I tell you what, we are going to have a little bit of a contest. We're going to test this band to see if they can come through with the WGAL challenge. That's it for now in York County. We'll have much more highlights coming up later on in the show, but for now, let's send it to Pat Principe, who has more Football Friday highlights. Pat? Hasse here at McCaskey Stadium, the Red Tornado tonight, trying to rebound from that... Susquehannock marching band bringing us back from uh, break. Happy birthday, Ricky Martin. What is he now, 19, 20? He might be a little older than that. I don't know. Time now, as you can tell by uh, my uh, choice of furniture here, it is time for the Wolf Furniture Armchair Quarterback Matchup of the night. We go to the mid-pen where Trinity has been cruising through the Liberty.